Did you know Charlie Brown's father was a barber? Okay, hey, what's up? It's a beautiful day. What's happening, internet? That's right. I have my own brand. Pretty much this is just making fun of Isaac Goley, just to prove that, you know, I'm clearly the superior one here. It's a beautiful day out. I'm stuck inside making videos for you. First off, Fox News cuts off Obama? That's crazy. He's doing his speech talking about the healthcare and everything. I don't really get the whole healthcare thing. It sounds like a good idea to me. Like, they just have to pay some more taxes, but they get free healthcare. Like, that's all I understand about it. Okay, he's talking about it and everything. And then they cut and they cut from his speech talking about the healthcare to talk about a pl they make up breaking news and show a video of a plane landing perfectly fine. Talk about breaking news. So yeah, maybe the plane was crashing, but like, it landed fine. Plus this is the president. You guys elected him. America, they elected him. They chose him over John McCain. I'm Canadian, okay? Like, eh, you know? But I would have voted for Obama if I was an American. It's weird, because you voted, they voted him. Now they all hate him. Yeah, Obama, he's the man! He's the best! He is black and he is my brother and he is kicking ass and he is going straight to the White House. Then they elect him. Then they're all like, the what? Who is this guy? Man, he's a sucker president. The man has his face in coffee. Check it out. That's crazy! Like, come on. Like, He's, he seems pretty cool. Like, I didn't hang out with him, I guess, maybe. Anyways, breaking news in my world, this bed, that's right, a Millennium Falcon bed. That's right, blew my mind, crazy. I would love to have that bed. The shit even lights up. That is awesome, man. If I had this bed, I'd be like, fuck yes. I'd be excited for bedtime. I'd be like, fuck yes, bedtime. I wish I had that bed. Okay, I gotta settle down. Anyways, again with Fox, Sarah Palin having her own show. And they advertise it with her interviewing LL Cool J and Toby Keith on it. LL Cool J and Toby Keith weren't too happy about this. Because they weren't even contacted by Fox to begin with. If you're gonna advertise something like that, maybe you should actually contact the people and make sure they're with the game plan. Like if I'm watching TV and then all of a sudden my face pops up on screen and they say they're interviewing me, I expect it to be contacted beforehand. And if I wasn't, I'd be like, what? I would sue their ass for having my face on the TV, but still be pretty happy that my face is on the TV. Overexposed. Okay, now it is the time for one of the segment thingies that I have. Another one. Here we go. It's time for support the hater. Okay, so pretty much since this is like the first video and everything, I don't really have a hater. I think I got someone. Kevin is the hater today. And now to the daily shout out. The shout out goes out to Kevin. Kevin is 17 years old. He does not have a YouTube account, I'm pretty sure, do you? He does not have a YouTube account, so you cannot check out any of his videos. So check it out. There's your shout out. Oh yeah, done. All edited and everything, sweet. Hey, that's fun. Hey, Isaac. What's, uh, not much. Just uh, finished doing uh, this rant video, this rant show for YouTube that I'm doing. Cool. Yeah. Wait a minute. What? What? Rant? Man, that's that's my show. Yeah, but this is ranting. It's my idea. You can't you can own just, an idea. Show, show me. Show me this. I, look at this. Okay. Is my 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 graphics right here. What are you? 
Did you know Charlie Brown's father was a barber? Man, that's my that's that's how I start my video. Get out of my face! Get out of my face! You get out of my face! You get out of my face! No! Fuck you, I'm gonna post it!